Hey gamers, so I've had a couple of people, <laughs> I would have loved to have said lots of people, um, asking why there's not been any updates on the channel for a while. Short answer, a lot of stuff going on in the real world unfortunately. So the reason I've not really done any streaming or anything like that is I've had to pack up most of the consoles uh, just as a preemptive measure because at the minute I'm not sure how much longer I'm going to be living in this house. So, we decided we were going to buy it off the landlord. Um, and with it being an ex-council, we knew that in the first five years of them owning it, they have to offer it the council back, which is fair enough. That's fine. We get that. Um, but then the problem arose that when we got to the solicitor stage of things, it was pointed out in the property registry that in the first ten years, they get first refusal. So, we're waiting on that basically so I don't know if a um, couple of months time I might not be living here I mean fingers crossed all being well um, their offer's not good enough and the landlord can sort of like be like no sorry better offer in place and we get it which <laughs> it'd be a lot better for me because then I can unbox everything um, and get back to business as usual but obviously, with that going off, I've really, really not been in the mood for putting on any shows or anything for anybody. Um, there's been a lot of day job related stress lately as well. Um, just because... Well, no, I'm, I'm not voicing my frustrations because someone from work's bound to see this. And that won't end well. <laughs> but suffice it to say, day job very stressful. Home life, very stressful. Um, so yeah, you, it, the, any of you that follow me on Xbox in particular will probably have seen that I have been online on the Xbox and I have been playing a few games like Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2, Monster Hunter World and Diablo 3 in particular. The reason I've been hitting up those three games is because I was very, very lucky with the Xbox One I acquired. My friend James didn't format it properly and it's still set as his home console. Now he is fully aware of this now, but it means that I have access to his full digital library. So he downloads a game, I get a copy too. So between playing Star Trek Online with my mate Jamie and then the other three games with him, uh, with James who I bought the Xbox off and Chris, um, that that's pretty much all my time's been. It's been day job, home, food, Xbox online with those guys weekends have been spent doing housework um, and, and anybody that follows me on on Twitter or anything will know that I've been selling a lot of my stuff like the the, the wall now is pretty bare I, I had like these shelving units behind me I had two or three shelves full of Mega Drive games I've now got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 Mega Drive games and one Master System game left. You know, I had the entire Pokemon collection and apart from Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon that's in that dual box set, they've all gone. They have all gone. Because I was getting money together for the solicitor's fees for this place. And I don't know how it's going to work out, if I'm honest. So yeah, that's why updates have been slow. That's why it's been literally four months because I checked the date of my uh, my last upload for that um, mini Mega Drive retro electro model unboxing. That that is why it's been so long, just because I've been. <sighs> far too preoccupied worrying about am I going to have to find a new place to live if so is the new place going to have space for the stuff because at the minute um, I mean we've been really lucky I, I can't thank Chris my landlord enough for you know what he's done for us we've been paying minimal rent on a really good property and the reason he's selling is because of that. It sort of left him in a bit of a dodgy financial state. And I am—I am not—I can't point to words how grateful I am to his, him and his wife, 
with how much they've helped me and my wife out. You know, so I am proper pinning my hopes on the fact that in a couple of months' time, I can look back at this video and go, <laughs> you idiot, everything turned out fine. <laughs> but, I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, this is going on far too long and it's bloody miserable. So I'm going to switch this off now and uh, yeah, this week I'm looking after my in-law's dog as well as my own, so I suppose I should go and uh, play with the puppers. Anyway, thanks for listening guys, I appreciate it. Um, hopefully I'll see you soon and the next update will be a bit more positive. And this is unedited this is a, a single take I'm not going to keep you know rehashing this one video just to get this one message out TLDR housing problems on the plus side at least his headset works as a decent mic <laughs> right anyway I'm off thanks for paying attention guys see you all soon